I mean, we just had a proven that we're a consistent team. Um, we come in with, you know, a focus of how we're going to win that specific game. And we talk about a lot of it's about us and how we, you know, approach the game. It was like 25 to 10 at one point. Uh, I had two terrible turnovers to start. They got breakaway layups. Um, they made some easy threes, and you look up and, you know, you spotted them 15, and we're good at ta- – we have enough talent that we can come back, obviously make the game interesting and, you know, take the lead into halftime, but we just haven't proven that we're intelligent enough, work, you know, play hard enough, have a focus enough to – string a couple, you know, good games together to have build that momentum. So until we do, we're just going to hover around 500 and not, not you know, break away from the pack at all. Seasons past, you guys have shown as incredible as you can be during the regular season. You guys set that record. That doesn't mean you're necessarily going to win to the finals. So do you think that there's at least like an understanding that as long as we get – like by the playoffs, like can't put too much stress on on any part of the regular season. Absolutely not this year. Just I mean, in those years we've had. I think I, we always say it every year presents a different challenge, and you do have to overcome that to accomplish whatever goal you set. And obviously, for us, championships are all, are always the goal. You know, last year we started eighteen and two, and then we had some rough patches. But at least you had a segment of the the season that you could say we had. We figured it out. Um, we might have had a game or two, but we've not had a stretch where consistently we've been able to say we figured it out. And you're going to lose games from time to time. There's talented teams all throughout the league, but a lot of it's either self-inflicted or, again, just not being able to prove that we have the identity that we need game after game. So um sense of urgency right now. Whatever the reason is, I think... Like I said, uh, it's just in, uh, all the mistakes are happening at the wrong times, whether it's to start the game or when you start to uh, build momentum within a specific you know part of the, uh, of the game and go on a run where you give the other team life, breakdowns on defense. It used to be offensive rebounds, and now it's kind of you know, it's kind of crept in a little bit. So uh, a lot of issues, but. You no, know, from a leadership standpoint, we have a lot of faith that we can. Like nobody's, you know, calling a quiz on on trying to figure it out. It's just a matter of can we do it or not, and we're gonna keep trying until we're proven otherwise. Which is like collective, like defensive effort on a possession by possession basis compared to last year. I mean, I think the effort is. Mm. The effort feels like it was there, especially these last two games. It's just when the effort meets IQ, meets execution. That's where we've uh, we gotta get all three of those working at the same time. And then, you know, then that should help us. But tonight, <clears throat> we, you you give Vucevic, you know, being able to just line up threes. And that's not just the bigs. That's a guards break down on on pressure on the ball, understanding the game plan where we need to send the ball so that we have built in help. Um, just too easy out there. So between him and Levine going for seventy together, like you're not gonna win uh, any games playing like that. So that's just a collective commitment to what we're trying to do.